boys and girls of Smithswood Primary Academy, you join me for the very last news report of the 2019-2020 academic year and what a year it has been. Let's celebrate this week's news headlines. We are the virtual school games winners. That's right, children from reception all the way through to year six have been taking part in a variety of Olymp Mix challenges. It has been fantastic to see children across the school taking part and as a result boys and girls you are gold that's right everybody in school has won that gold medal for school congratulations to all the staff and children who have participated in the Olympic challenge next we move on to our John Muir award winners the pupils in year six who have already been presented with their certificates maintaining social distancing of course. Congratulations to you, a fantastic achievement uh, working with Mr Matthews throughout the course of the year on your outdoor learning is good to see. Well done. Let's cross over live to an interview with a pupil in year six. I'm here with the Shade Lee of year six, a model pupil here at Smithwood Primary Academy who has attended school since 2012. Lachey, what have you enjoyed most about attending Smithwood Primary Academy for the last eight years? Uh, meeting all of the teachers and all my friends here because they're really nice people. And have you got any fun memories that you'd like to share with the staff and students of school? Uh, when I climbed up Snowdon in Wales, um, and all of the other trips that I've been to because they've been really fun. Fantastic. And have you got a message for Miss Givens, the staff and the pupils at Smithwood Primary Academy? Um, thank you for teaching me and thank you for being such kind friends to me and I'm going to miss you when I go to secondary school. And finally, Lily Shea, for you personally, what are you looking forward most to attending secondary school? <laughs> Wearing a tie. Wearing a tie, fantastic. Lachey has been a model pupil at this school. This has been the news. We will see you in September. Good luck to our year six pupils in their next endeavours as they move on to new horizons. Secondary schools near and far, I'm sure, are looking forward to welcoming you in September. We bid farewell to you for now, but look forward to touching base with some of you in the future. Congratulations. They're not the only people in school we say goodbye to because unfortunately children, the wonderful Miss Shilaka who works in our school office as you know has done so for a number of years. Too many years for me to advertise on this recording. However, Miss Shilaka will be missed, significantly missed, not only by her colleagues but children around the school, especially those who have attended to Miss Shilaka's first aid skills over the course of the years. Well done Miss Shilaka and happy retirement. We also say goodbye to Mr Toza who's going to work in a school closer to home. Thank you for your work too Mr Toza and we wish you all the very best in the future. Big celebrations for us as a school who have welcomed back close to 300 pupils like no other school in the authority, like no other school in the country. We remain COVID safe. We remain COVID secure with no reported cases. That's a big well done to you children for washing your hands more regularly, for following the hygiene procedures, from staying in your bubbles and listening to the guidance of all the staff around school. What a huge effort. Well done to all of you. Which brings me on to our final news item. It's the summer holidays. That's right, school's out for approximately six weeks. So we wish you a safe summer. Enjoy time at home with your families. Be safe, stay safe, and we look forward to welcoming you back in September, looking nice and smart in your school uniforms, ready to be outstanding once again. <laughs>